400 tons. Cost between six to seven point five million dollars. Four thousand six hundred horsepower. Made for haul material. Why does a truck need to be so big? You're about to find out as we explore a truck so massive it could make a Freightliner Cascadia look like a toy in comparison. Meet the Bellaz's 75710, the world's biggest haul truck, designed to carry jaw-dropping amounts of material across some of the harshest environments on Earth. And guess what? It's not just big for show. This truck hauls an unbelievable 450 tons of material in one trip. But that's not the most shocking part. Stick around and you'll learn just how this beast works, what it's made of, and why it dominates other trucks in its class. Let's dive into the world of mega haul trucks and see what makes the Bellaz 75710 the true giant of the mining world. Can we get 5,000 likes on this video? And don't forget to subscribe. So why does the Bellazzi 75710 have to be this enormous? In industries like mining, efficiency is king. Moving vast quantities of rock and minerals quickly is essential. And the more a truck can carry in one go, the less time and money spent on fuel, manpower, and maintenance. The Bellazzi 75710 can carry up to 450 tons of material, which is 25% more than its closest competitors. Imagine stacking over 400 family-sized SUVs into the bed of one truck. Yeah, that's how massive it is. In fact, just moving this empty truck requires immense power. We're talking about a 400-ton vehicle even before loading it up. Its size isn't just for bragging rights. It's a key player in keeping operations running smoothly in mines and quarries across the globe, from the frozen tundras of Siberia to the rocky landscapes of South America. Now let's talk numbers. The Bellaz 75710 can haul up to 450 tons per load. To put that into perspective, a standard dump truck carries around 20 tons. This thing can haul 22 times that amount in one go. And that's why it's used in the world's largest open pit mines. There's simply no other truck that can match its capacity. But wait, there's more. Even though it's carrying these mammoth loads, it can still move at speeds of up to 64 kilometers per hour, 40 miles per hour, thanks to its dual engine setup. This means that not only does it carry more, but it also gets the job done faster. What powers this monster of a truck? The Bellaz 75710 is driven by two 16-cylinder, four-stroke diesel engines, each producing 2,300 horsepower. But that's not all. The truck also features four AC traction motors that give it the extra muscle it needs to move these massive loads over rugged terrain. It's basically two trucks combined into one. The truck's fuel consumption is pretty staggering though. It burns through about 1,300 liters of diesel per 100 kilometers. To put that in perspective, that's more fuel than a family car uses in an entire year just to drive 62 miles. But when you consider the sheer amount of material it's moving, it actually works out to be fuel efficient for the job it's doing. Plus, it can run on just one engine when carrying lighter loads, which helps reduce fuel consumption. Now, where is this beast being used? The Bellaz 75710 is primarily employed in Russia, South America, Southeast Asia, and Africa, especially in harsh mining environments. In fact, it's currently being tested in one of the most unforgiving places on Earth, Siberia's Krubachatsky Open Pit Coal Mine. This mine is notorious for its extreme weather conditions where temperatures can drop to minus 50 degrees Celsius, making it a true proving ground for any machine. The Bellaz 75710 is designed to handle this and more, operating in both freezing and scorching conditions. How does the Bellaz 75710 compare with other giants of the truck world? 
Let's break it down. Take the Caterpillar 797F, for example. It's a powerhouse in its own right, but it can only carry 400 tons. The Komatsu 980E4 hauls a bit less, with a capacity of 45 tons, but the Bell Oz 75710 tops them all at 450 tons. In fact, the Bell Oz is 25% larger in terms of payload capacity than the next closest competitor. Weight-wise, the Freightliner Cascadia, a well-known semi-truck, weighs about 18 tons fully loaded. That's not even close to the 400 tons empty weight of the Bell Oz's 75710. Think about that, this mining truck weighs 20 times more than a regular highway truck. So far, only a few of these trucks have been built. Belas has produced just three units of the 75710 with another one currently under construction. Each of these behemoths costs a staggering six to $7.5 million to build, and each unit is custom designed for the specific mining operations that will use it. It's not your typical off-the-shelf product. Maintaining a truck of this size is no small feat. Each tire weighs about six tons and costs up to $90,000 to replace. You've got eight of them on this truck, and that's just the tires. The truck also requires specialized mechanics to service its engines, suspension, and electric systems, which means downtime for repairs can be costly for mining companies. But Belaz has thought of that too. They've designed the 75710 to use parts from their earlier 75600 model. So mechanics don't need extra training to work on it. Plus, they've created virtual simulators to help operators learn how to drive the truck efficiently and safely. As mining operations grow, the demand for bigger and more efficient trucks like the Belaz 75710 will only increase. Belaz is investing millions in research and development to ensure that its trucks remain at the cutting edge of the industry, with plans to enter more markets in Australia, North America, and beyond. So what do you think? Does bigger mean better in the world of trucks? The Belaz 75710 sure makes a compelling case for it. Its massive size, unmatched hauling capacity, and cutting edge technology truly set it apart from every other truck out there. If you're amazed by this engineering marvel, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more content on the world's most incredible machines. Stay tuned for more jaw-dropping tech and transport stories.